spray some WD-40 to help it loose, break loose. I think I'm going to turn this on the other side so this way I can uh, loosen this. I just flipped it to the side so now I'm just going to quickly remove these two bolts. just you know kind of scare uh, let's try this one okay this one is break loose too I hate to hear those breaking noise because it's kind of scary um, now I think I can throw it back because that's not a good position to be in because my um, oil is on the other side. That's why they don't want you to tilt it on, on that side. Okay. 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 Now I can start loosening those two bolts. easier to use tool than use my finger. Here we go. This one is out. This looks pretty good. Should use some oil in there. some WD-40. So those are the four bolts. Remiss. I'm gonna turn this thing to its side. To this side. Then I'll be able to, you know, Kind of shake loose the midsection. You see here, it's a midsection. But then, I think I need to loosen these two. before I can get to the midsection. Because these two are locked. Let me push this motor upwards. Let's see if I can remove this lower unit here. Mid of Smith section. Okay, now I should be able to somehow drop the mid section.
What else is connected to this midsection? Nothing. Okay, this bridge, this is out. Yeah, but uh, ooh, push this down. Um, you know, I'm just gonna wiggle this. Maybe use a hammer to hammer here so that the section can come down to tightly sealed. This section is tightly sealed. I don't see anywhere that's, uh, you know, so I'm gonna spray some WD 40 into these holes. Hopefully, break loose the connection here. I just sprayed the WD 40 into those holes. Can, uh, totally separate this lower unit as you can see here and uh, drop this lower unit from the this section you know because lower the this section and the lower unit comes out in one piece before this one was caught in the in the robber here now the lower section can come out in one piece um Lower section and this section can come out totally, you know. So now I have this, uh, this, uh, here. Right now you can see the seal of my Honda A horsepower. This exhaust seal looks completely in the perfect condition. You know, there's not, it's not broken at all, you know, so... I don't know. I don't know where it could be the leak that um, leak into into the um, into the um, power head section, you know, because it's you know. Some, Perfect condition. This is the water, water um, tube, and the exhaust. The exhaust is not um, leaking at all. You know, it's amazing. And that's the drive shaft, drive drive shaft, and also the um, drive shaft. And also the gear shaft. Well, gear gear shaft is through this hole here. This this hole here. Drive shaft jack shaft is uh, in the in the back uh, deep down there. There are three bolts holding the drive shaft drive shaft down. And um, this is the exhaust. You know, I don't see any leak at all from this. This seal is pretty solid. <laughs> 